Glad to have you back with us in the BetMGM studio. And glad to have back with us in the BetMGM studio, Titans general manager John Robinson. It's good to see you here again. Oh, it's good to be back live and in person, Mike. All right. I want to talk about Caleb Farley, who we've already met in this edition of Titans All Access. What separated Caleb Farley, not just from the other cornerbacks, but from the other players so that you decided to take him in the first round? He had outstanding size, uh, speed, athleticism. He was a pretty guy to, to evaluate on, on film with the production that he had. And then the more that we talked to the staff and the coaches, you know, that had kind of touched him along the way there in his career at Virginia Tech. I'm just an outstanding guy that was committed to the team effort. Smart football player with a tireless work ethic. Elijah Molden is another guy that you drafted. What makes him unique? What is he going to contribute to the secondary? He's a versatile player. You know, he can he can play safety. He can play outside corner. He's played nickel. He's tough. He's dependable. He's extremely smart. One of our more impressive interviews, he had watched three or four games of our defensive film from this past season. And he commented about how he liked um, the way we used our nickel with blitzes, with coverage concepts. Let's talk about receivers. And I want to start in free agency. You signed Josh Reynolds away from the Rams. What'd you like about Josh Reynolds? Outstanding size, um, competitive player. He's got this sneaky speed to him. Because he's such a longer, taller player, you don't think he's moving, but then he's pulling past defensive backs. He can play inside, he can play outside. Really big catch radius for red zone opportunities. And, and he's not afraid to go in there and dig out a, you know, dig out a linebacker or a safety in the run game as a blocker. You drafted two wideouts, Racy McMath and Des Fitzpatrick. Other than the obvious wide receiver traits that they have, was their size part of what set them apart? Yeah, both of those guys had outstanding size and, and speed. You know, Racy timed really, really fast. Both of those guys, the one thing that set those guys apart was their competitiveness, their toughness, both as blockers, um, both with the ball in their hands after the catch, and Racy on special teams. You know, he, he was a demon in the kicking game for Coach Ogeron down at LSU. You drafted in the second round an offensive lineman out of North Dakota State by the name of Dylan Radens. Could have drafted a lot of linemen. What set Dylan Radens apart? Really his size, his athleticism, his length, uh, his makeup, his traits. Extremely competitive. Um, had a great week down at the Senior Bowl. Uh, you could see it in the practices. You could see it in the game. He was one of our interview guys down there in, in, in Mobile and was just an impressive guy to talk to. He's about what we're about, you know, with the offensive line and how they play stylistically and, and a really good fit and a guy that we think can really plug in at any four spots. Amy is going to visit with Bud Dupree later in this edition of Titans All Access. And what I want to know is as you were going through free agency looking for an edge rusher, what led you to Bud Dupree? Well, I think he impacts the game, you know, at the end of the line of scrimmage, you know, whether it's the run game or the passing game. Pittsburgh moved him around a little bit and, and kind of played, you know, that joker position or buck position where, you know, he might line up on the guard, he might line up and he rushes and he blitzes or he drops. Danico Autry is a player that we're very familiar with from his time with the Raiders and the Colts. He's listed as a defensive lineman, but is his versatility what makes him so appealing? Yeah, I'm glad we don't got a block and we're playing with him rather than against him. But, you know, he's a guy, again, that, that you know, he's, he lines up over, over the guard. I mean, heck, he played some nose tackle for Indy sometimes. Uh, you could stand him up, you can play him over the tackle. A really tough, physical, aggressive uh, style to his play. And a guy that, again, adds some versatility to the mix with that front for us. John Robinson, it has been an exciting offseason so far. Thanks for sharing the details to this point. We look forward to visiting with you again. Thanks for having me in. More Titans All Access coming your way after this.